ਵਾਂਸ ਅਗੇਨ ਵੈਲਕਮ ਬੈਕ ਟੂ ਦਾ ਪ੍ਰੋਗਰਾਮ ਅੱਜ ਦੇ ਸੈਗਮੈਂਟ ਵਿੱਚ ਤੁਹਾਡੀ ਮੁਲਾਕਾਤ ਕਰਾਵਾਂਗੇ ਅਸੀਂ ਮੇਪਲ ਰਿਜ ਮਿਸ਼ਨ ਤੋਂ ਆਏ ਹੋਏ ਸਾਡੇ ਮਹਿਮਾਨ ਮਾਈਕ ਬਾਕਿੰਗ ਨਾਲ ਇਹ ਉਥੋਂ ਐਨਡੀਪੀ ਦੇ ਉਮੀਦਵਾਰ ਹਨ ਸੋ ਵੀਲ ਬੀ ਟਾਕਿੰਗ ਟੂ ਹਿਮ ਇਨ ਇੰਗਲਿਸ਼ ਐਂਡ ਉਸ ਤੋਂ ਬਾਅਦ ਅਖੀਰ ਵਿੱਚ ਮੈਂ ਜ਼ਰੂਰ ਟ੍ਰਾਂਸਲੇਟ ਕਰਕੇ ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਨਾਲ ਗੱਲਬਾਤ ਕਰਾਂਗਾ ਕਿ ਇਹਨਾਂ ਦੇ ਕੀ ਵਿਚਾਰ ਨੇ ਤੇ ਕਿਉਂ ਇਹ ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਤੋਂ ਵੋਟਾਂ ਮੰਗਣ ਆਏ ਹਨ ਵੈਲਕਮ ਟੂ ਦਾ ਪ੍ਰੋਗਰਾਮ ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ ਵੈਰੀ ਮਚ ਥੈਂਕ ਯੂ ਸੋ ਮਾਈਕ ਅ ਲਿਟਲ ਬਿਟ ਅਬਾਊਟ ਯੋਰਸੈਲਫ ਵਾਟ ਹੈਵ ਯੂ ਬੀਨ ਡੂਇੰਗ ਐਂਡ ਐਂਡ ਹਾਊ ਡਿਡ ਯੂ ਥਿੰਕ ਆਫ ਜੰਪਿੰਗ ਇਨਟੂ ਪ੍ਰੋਵਿੰਸ਼ੀਅਲ ਪੋਲਿਟਿਕਸ ਸ਼ੂਰ ਵੈਲ ਓਰੀਜਨਲੀ ਆਈ ਸਟਾਰਟਡ ਐਜ਼ ਅ ਰਿਪੋਰਟਰ ਵਿਦ ਦ ਵੈਂਕੂਵਰ ਸਨ ਨਿਊਜ਼ਪੇਪਰ ਸੋ ਆਈ ਐਮ ਇਨ ਦ ਸੇਮ ਬਿਜ਼ਨਸ ਐਜ਼ ਯੂ ਯੈਸ and that was way back in uh, 1978 as uh, when right. i left uh, the university of bc uh-huh. where where i worked in the student newspaper there so i worked in the newspaper business for about 10 years or so when i was elected uh, president of the union that represents okay. newspaper workers in british columbia right and so that's been essentially my job for the last while um i live in the mission uh, area mm-hmm. uh, community of silverdale um where i'm married to callie and where we have three girls wonderful So um my original interest in politics actually began when our girls were going to uh school mm-hmm. here in Surrey where okay. we are now right. and uh and we were concerned at that time about the quality of the schools and so we became active in the parents advisory committee and so on like that right. and one thing just kind of led to another and involvement in first just that grassroots kind of politics right. uh and seeing <laughs> that uh, politics does matter government does matter right. and that you can affect change okay. if you get involved. And mm-hmm. so it started at that level and has continued to this day and so that's why I'm running now in Maple Ridge Mission for the NDP. Why the NDP? Well, because it's the party that corresponds with my beliefs. Okay. I believe in a in a caring uh, compassionate society, but mm-hmm. I also believe in the NDP that is being led now by our leader Adrian Dix mm-hmm. that is also pragmatic and practical. Right. So we want change, we want change for the better. and but we want to do it in a practical way one that uh that makes sense and that we can um economically afford as well mm-hmm. if you could let us know a little bit about the demographics of your uh, riding maple ridge mission sure. and uh, the kind of communities who are living over there and also especially when you are going door knocking campaigning what kind of issues and challenges are being faced by the people right so maple ridge and mission uh are communities that are relatively young although mm-hmm. the communities themselves have been around for a long time uh there's a lot of young families right. uh uh property prices are a little more affordable out there so we get a lot of young families mm-hmm. so as you can imagine uh education is a big issue. Uh right. a lot of families are concerned about uh their f- the future of their children. Mm-hmm. And so because of that, one of the things that's very important to us is finding ways to improve our education system. We don't believe there's been enough investment in okay. education. Um we're a province that has magnificent resources whether mm-hmm. it's forestry or mining or uh our 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 environment and uh but really the most uh the strongest most powerful resource we have is really our young people right. and their future mm-hmm. and so education is of primary concern for us in this election and right. so it's certainly a concern of mine mm-hmm. other issues that we hear at the door in um in Maple Ridge and Mission are issues of affordability right. many people feel squeezed because of all of the different kinds of increases in the many different fees that they have to pay whether it's MSP premiums or mm-hmm. ferry rates or tolls on bridges and right. so on um and and essentially this has been a tax shift uh, that the me- middle class has had to to bear right. to pay for the tax cuts that were made to the wealthy and large corporations by mm-hmm. the BC Liberals so we're we we are aware of that affordability ability issue and mm-hmm. and we want to do what we can practically to to try and alleviate that. And then I guess one last uh, issue that's uh, pretty important uh, there's a lot of issues but uh, another issue that we hear a lot at the doorstep is transportation. Okay. Public transit uh, Maple Ridge and Mission are commuting type of communities right. and so transportation is very important mm-hmm. whether it's public transit or the roads and the bridges and so on like that. Right. So So that will also be a very important Great. concern. What about the health care in your area? Health care is, it- is important too. Mm-hmm. Uh in fact, we were very concerned after the last election, 2009, mm-hmm. when the government announced that they were planning to close the emergency ward of Mission Memorial Hospital. Right. And uh that created a huge uproar in the community and right. I was involved in that as well, mm-hmm. um protesting the closure of the um of the emergency ward at right. Mission Memorial. Mm-hmm. Uh we got Carol James who was the leader of the NDP out to time. Mission at that time and right. Adrian Dix who was the health critic at that time. Mm-hmm. Anyway, that strong protest 
uh, made the government reverse their decision to close the emergency ward. Mm -hmm. But uh, the, the, the people of Mission and Maple Ridge for Ridge Meadows feel very strongly about their hospitals and their health care and, right. and are concerned about any kind of, of uh, uh, degradation of it. Mm -hmm. In fact, we want to see improvements. When we talk about the composition of that a particular riding, yes. uh, what's the kind of work which people are doing and uh, what mm -hmm. about the different communities which are living over there? Well, um, there's a lot of people that commute mm -hmm. uh, and, and work in other places, which is why transportation is important. Right. It's uh, m much of the community is working class in the sense that they, they, they work at a variety of, of jobs, right. um, uh, tradespeople, mm -hmm. uh, but also uh, clerical going into the city and 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 also business people too. Uh, there's a strong Indo-Canadian community in mm -hmm. Mission, the west side of Mission, right. uh, which is very vibrant. It's it, it it's a very important part of our community. It's mm -hmm. centered around the Mission um, uh, Sikh temple there. Right. And uh, actually, I was just there on on Saturday on Sunday mm -hmm. to help celebrate uh, Vasaki. Okay. Uh, so it's a very very important part of our community. Um, so what's the kind of response you're getting from the public when you're going and talking to them and as you raise these issues, so they right. must be concerned about it. But right. uh, again, uh, there's another thing which is coming forward is the economy. And yes. that's what the opposition party is stressing upon, that we are the ones who can provide you a stable economy. So are these issues discussed when you go over there? Very much so. Uh, but in terms of uh, the Liberals' performance on the economy, you don't hear that from the people. Mm -hmm. They're very concerned about the state of the economy and about how it seems to be rigged against regular folks. Mm -hmm. And so um, that's a concern. You also uh, um, want, as I was mentioning earlier, people are concerned about issues of affordability and right. being able to... Uh, uh, make do in, mm -hmm. in this world. So right. um, w w in terms of economic issues, uh, my belief is we need to work towards a much more diversified economy. Okay. We can't put all of our eggs in one, one basket, basket, right? right? Mm -hmm. uh, not just mining, not just forestry, right. not just tourism. Mm -hmm. It's all of them working together, the film industry. Right. And also some important uh, uh, initiatives of, of things that we traditionally think is of part of the government, health care and education are also important drivers of the economy. Right. In fact, we believe that one of the things that will uh, help the economy the most mm -hmm. is the skills training that right. we've said is a top priority of us. Right. Because uh, business uh, businesses are crying out mm -hmm. for properly skilled workers. Right. The Liberals, uh, when they came into power back in 2001, cut a lot of the apprenticeship programs and okay. so on. So this will be a major focus, what you will be talking if you are elected as an MLA. And towards the Absolutely. end, uh, why should the public vote for Mike Buckley? Well, for all of the reasons we've just talked about, mm -hmm. we're, we're in favor of a, of a strong economy right. that's able to provide the mm -hmm. uh, social services we need, good education, uh, good health care, mm -hmm. uh, and that um, will practically look at making mm -hmm. lives better for people in Maple Ridge and Mission and right. British Columbia. Uh -huh. And also, how do you assure them that what you are promising now, you will stand by that when you, if you are elected? Yeah, and that's, that is probably the, the number one question that I think this election is really all about. Right. Because a lot of voters feel particularly burned by what happened in 2009, right. where the Liberals of the time said they would not bring an HST and mm -hmm. then bring an HST. So we have been very clear, Adrian Dix has been very clear, mm -hmm. that we will say what we are going to do and we will describe how we will be able to do it. Right pragmatically, one practical step at a time. Great. Thank you very much, Mike. Thank and you. And best wishes for May the 14th. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you very much. It's been a pleasure meeting you. Thanks. Thank you. So, I just see Maple Ridge Mission to IOS Sade Mehman, Mike Bakhtin, and Tordi Galbaat Karai. And they have their vision, and they have their party vision, and they have their party vision. They have said that there are many issues, many issues, many challenges that people face. They have their own transport, their own transport, their own transport, their own commuting, their own transport, 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 their own चौदह मई में जो वोटा पैनिया ने तो इस असी इस करके सारे उम्मीदवार तो सामने लैके आ रहे हैं कि तुम जान सको पहचान सको इन की सोच है क्योंकि पार्टी की सोच बारे तो तुम्हें तो पता ही है पर एक उम्मीदवार जो तो रिप्रजेंट करना है वो की सोच रखता है इस बारे तो जानू करा रहे हैं